didn't realize this until I started talking, but um, I'm doing a review of Steel Magnolias. Magnolias is a flower, and I'm wearing a roses shirt for a magnolia review. If you have a magnolia shirt, that's really awesome. But I have roses. It's pretty cool. Steel Magnolias. This film was released back in 1989 and continuing on the little classic movie reviews that I have never seen that my mom is telling me to watch. If you watched my Terms of Endearment review the other day, I mentioned my mom has like a list of movies that I have not seen that she tells me I need to watch. So I'm continuing on that and I am watching this movie tonight. And once I finished it, I was like... That was a really good girls movie. This film stars Sally Field, Dolly Parton, Julia Roberts, and Daryl Hannah, and is about a young beautician newly arrived in a small Louisiana town, finds work at the local salon, where a small group of women share a close bond of friendship and welcome her into the fold. Now before getting started in the review, this review will contain spoilers. Like me, I have seen this movie, so if you've not seen this movie, then watch it, like I just did. And so now let's get into this movie. I very much had fun with this movie. It was a very funny movie, very dramatic, and very good performances by a group of this women. And the movie is very simple. That plot line I just read from IMDb, that's like the first 10 minutes of the movie. This movie, is, there's a lot more deeper character study in this movie and more of a, like it truly is a group of women who are great friendship and they go with this tragedy, heartfelt moments, comedy moments, like they go through everything together. The performances in this movie are all fantastic. I think every woman in this movie has their moment to shine. Sally Field is fantastic there is one scene in particular toward the end of this movie after the burial of her daughter there is a great moment of her just losing it kind of of her laughing crying and de entering depression and then laughing about it with her friends like sally field in this movie to me is amazing sally field is a like one of the best actresses ever in my opinion she is fantastic in most movies she is in and this movie she's she almost steals every scene, but the real person that steals every scene for me, who I did learn was nominated for Supporting Actress, Julia Roberts, who was beautiful in this movie. She is so pretty in real life, and in this movie, I want to date her and, like, love her and get to know her and buy her flowers and chocolates and then kiss her a bunch. But for real, though, Julia Roberts is actually fantastic in this movie, and there is a good reason why she was nominated for Supporting Actress for this movie back in 1989. She is fantastic, and what her character goes through and how her leads to her death and her husband is left behind with a young boy and her mom is there, and it is such a heartbreaking scene, like I said, at the funeral when Sally Field breaks down. It is a amazing stuff by these performers and all the other women in this group are great. Dolly Parton is amazing. Shirley MacLaine is amazingly funny in this movie. Olympia DeChusi is great in this movie. I mean all these women give amazing performances especially Shirley MacLaine. She is hilarious. She has some of the best lines throughout this entire movie. Shirley MacLaine who I just reviewed in terms of endearment in this movie as well. She is amazing and she is so funny. She made, her character made me and my mom laugh the entire time watching this movie. Especially her with her dog and how the man is always shooting the gun. The dog is freaking out and losing her hair or whatever. And she's always walking with her big bag. And she's always got like a tight ass, whatever. It is great. And watch this movie, I can now get some of these quotes. And I love just these women and these characters and the, the story, it was fun. But it also led to a very dramatic ending and I was I was entertained and I, and I was sad. I teared up at the very end seeing Julia Roberts go away. It was depressing. I'm gonna give Steel Magnolias a B plus. So like I said in my Terms of Endearment review, I'm reviewing a bunch of classic movies I haven't seen but a lot of you did give me some suggestions. Most of them I have seen unfortunately because I've seen a bunch of movies but my mom is helping me review movies so there's gonna be reviews on here, you're like, whoa, where did that come from? It's just me and my mom's little personal little list of movies I haven't seen. But anyway, still leave a comment down below and tell me a movie that you think I should review. Because there are movies I want to review that are classics that I've already seen that I totally will review. I don't know. We'll figure it all out. 2021. What a year already. Anyway, guys, guys, I hope you guys enjoy this video, and I will see you guys on the next one. Bye-bye, everyone.